characteristic properties of the matter. Particles of matter have space between them. The activities done in the previous sections demonstrate that the sum type substances distribute themselves when put in water. This shows that there is enough space between the particles for them to mix. Particles of the matter are continuously moving. To understand these concepts, we will perform a series of activities. Activity We need an incense stick and a matchbox for this activity. Case 1 Take an unlit incense stick and keep it at a distance of few rows of desks from you. You will notice that you cannot smell the incense stick from where you are located. If you place it on your hand and bring it sufficiently close to your nose, you can sense the aroma of it. Case 2 Now, light the incense stick using matches. Place it in the corner of the room. You will notice that after some time, the smell of the incense can be sensed all over the room. For this activity, you need honey, ink, two beakers and water. Place two beakers on the table and fill both of them with water. Put few drops of ink in the first beaker and same amount of honey in the second. Leave the setup undisturbed for about 10 minutes. You will notice that in the ink in the beaker is almost spread more in the water than that of the honey. If you leave it for another hour, the ink is almost completely dispersed and there is a lot of honey at the bottom of the beaker. For this activity you will need copper sulphate, two beakers, cold water and hot water. Place the two beakers in the table and fill one of them with hot water and the other one with cold water. Drop equal amount of copper sulphate into both the beakers. Leave the beakers undisturbed. Allow some time to pass. You will notice that the beaker with hot water has more copper sulphate dissolved compared to the one with the cold water. From the above activities, we can conclude the following. Particles of matter are continuously in motion. The rate at which the particles move increases with the temperature which means that the kinetic energy of the particles also increases temperature. The intermixing of different types of particles is called as diffusion. The rate at which the diffusion occurs is also dependent on the temperature. Activity for this activity, you will need a piece of chalk, a rubber band and an iron nail. You will try to break the structure of these different substances now. You will notice that it is easy to break the chalk with a hammer. And it is also easy to cut a rubber band with a blade. You will also find that it is extremely unlikely that you can break or cut the nail with a hammer and a blade. From this we conclude that the particles in iron are held together with the strongest force. Activity Don't waste the water. Allow the water to fall into a bucket or a trough. Open a tap of water and let the water fall in a stream. Use your finger to cut the stream of water. You will notice that even though you can easily do it, the water can also flow in a stream with the particles attached together. From the above activities, we understand that the strength of forces between the particles changes with the kind of matter.